Hello, it's David with InvestorsHangout.com. Today, I'd like to do a video on a question we get asked all the time. How do I find stocks to buy? Where should I be looking at? Who should I be watching? These are all questions I used to ask myself back in the day when I used to trade stocks. And, you know, once you put together a strategy, it, it really helps out and really worked well for me. What I would do is I would search and look for stocks that are running, stocks that just recently ran. I wouldn't run and buy the stock right then and there, obviously, because you want to buy the stock before it runs to make the most amount of money. And I'd look at and see who was posting and talking about that stock in the weeks leading up to it. Okay, that was my strategy. And then I would start putting together a very, very long list of a bunch of aliases, peoples, uh, online, on Twitter, and, and start start putting together everything. And then I would start watching what they were doing. Okay, so if somebody was posting about it and it started running and I got like eight out of 10, okay, now they're talking about these 10 and eight of them are, are running, I would pay attention to those people. That is exactly what I did. Now, I would use stock charts as, as a reference, okay? So if I see somebody talking about the stock, I have a good feeling about it, I would not run and buy. I would start my due diligence right there. So I would go to stock charts. I'd look at there. If I see some volume starting to pick up, there's a little bit of loading going on or whatever the case might be, my eyes would be pinned. I would be looking at that company's information. When was the last news? Uh, Anything that I can find out, why are these people posting about it? I would just reach out to them and say, hey, what do you know? I mean, do you know something that I don't know? Uh, right there, that is exactly how I started. So uh, I would like to go over four stocks today and, and give you that example uh, firsthand on what I'm talking about. So if you go up here to the right-hand corner and type in NASDAQ and hit enter, you're going to be brought to the search result. Go down here and click NASDAQ dip and rip. Now, this board right here is very popular for the big boards. Um, big board stocks are mainly this board. So make sure you board market. And so if you come here and click on your favorites, the board would be right there. It makes it much easier. So uh, go down here to the search bar. We're going to talk about STEM. I'm going to give you exactly what I would be looking for. So this stock just recently ran, right? So what I would do is go down here. I mean, this was a big run. We're talking 600%. Um, who was posting about it before the 816 run? And you see this right here, STEM, like this one for Friday. Okay, so to give you, uh, you know, an example right there. Okay, now I'm going to start watching what this guy's posting about. Same thing with this guy, Rhythm Guitar. Uh, you see Fitz Cars. They're all talking about it leading up to the weeks that stock ran. So right then and there, I would be paying attention to these people. I wouldn't sit there and babysit them or stalk them or anything like that. I would just pay attention to what they're talking about on the board. So what we're going to look at now is the MVP board. If you go up here to the top right, type in MVP. Investors hang out MVPs. This board right here is uh, more of smaller caps. A lot of people talking about penny stocks and uh, smaller cap stocks here. So go down to the search bar. This time we're going to use Strikeforce, S-F-O-R. Uh, this one just recently ran 900%. Um, so we're going to look at that, okay? Look at this, March 4th, March 5th, the 18th, uh, the 19th, the 25th. So right there, pay attention to them people. That's what I would do. Uh, BTGI, another one. Okay, we see people talking about it before that run. All leading up. Uh, another example P J E T. We're gonna search that one. Okay, now this one recently ran, so we're gonna go back to the August eighth date. Okay, now we see it right here. Now, what was he posting about? I, he posted before it, it started running. So, I mean, this is all stuff that I would pay attention to. I would use Twitter. Uh, you know. Use Twitter as a key too. Who's posting about the stock before it's running? You start your research there. Uh, again, if this if this video helped you, please click like. Make sure you subscribe. I'm going to have a lot of videos coming out uh, going over all different areas of the market. And hey, check out investorshangout.com. It's 100% free, unlimited posts, unlimited private messages from user to user, and hope to see you guys on the boards. Thank you. 
With the Small Cap Market Special Report for Public Wire, I'm Dave Darnlin. InvestorsHangout.com is where investors from all over the world go for information on their favorite stocks. The InvestorsHangout.com website features some of the hottest stock message boards online today. In addition, you can chat with other investors as well. And Investor Hangout features over 12 different stock exchanges from around the world, along with videos on some of the hottest talked about stocks in the markets today. Join the over 25,000 plus active investors who call InvestorsHangout.com their home. You can go to Investors Hangout today. That's InvestorsHangout.com.